Hi, in this video, I will show you how to configure server based GPA authentication using TACAX on Router 2. Firstly, I will configure a backup user account on Router 2. So, in case of the TACAX server is down, we will use its local account to log in to Router 2. The next step, we verify the TACAC server configuration. Now we click on the TACAC server and check for the information, the network configuration. And the user setup. Okay. Now the next step, we will configure the TACAC server specifics on Router 2. We use the command TACAC server host and the IP address of the TACAC server. And then we configure the key. The next step, we will config GPA login authentication for console access on Router 2. Firstly, we enable GPA on Router 2 and config all logins to authenticate using the GPA TACAC server. If the TACAC server is not available, then we use the local database. Now, we will configure GPA authentication for console login to use the default GPA authentication method. We move to the light console zero and log in authentication default. And the last step, we will verify the GPA authentication method. We return to the user exit mode. As you can see, we have to enter the account on TACAC server. As you can see, we can log in to the router to using the account on the TACAC server. Thanks for watching.